guys welcome back this is Enzo Pokeru I'm back again with 13th session of vocabulary today I have picked most of the words from the newspaper Kathmandu Post and Himalayan Times and I have also presented I am also trying to present some of idioms which I like a lot okay so without delaying let's start the session with first word of the day. first word of the day is be no this is not what this is an idiom be on one's consent this means to be a persistent cause or source of guilt such as an act of wrongdoing he didn't want that on his consent any longer so he told the truth that he stole a bracelet he he didn't want to regret he didn't want to feel uh, he didn't want to uh, make himself source of guilt, so he told that he stole on the bracelet. Another sentence: Yesterday, I was rude to an old woman who was asking me about the direction of some places, and it's been on my conscience since ever, ever since. I talked to a woman very rudely, which is making me feeling guilty, which make me feel guilty. Uh, since that time today all in the morning i got irritated and talked back to my wife which is on my concerns i i talked back to my wife i yelled at my wife so it is making me feel guilty right another idiom another idiom is rule of thumb rule of thumb means a general guideline rather than a strict rule an approximate measure or means of reckoning based on experience or common knowledge. As per general rule of thumb, we shouldn't go out if someone sneezes in the meantime. We should wake up early in the morning as per rule of thumb. Another word is Ferrari. Ferrari means uproar, enthusiastic anger, excitement or commotion. Because of the Ferrari going in my mind, I can make the right decision. Another word, impeach, to hinder, to pay, to prevent, to bring a legal proceeding against a public official. President Clinton was impeached by the House in November 1999, but since the Senate acquitted him, he was not removed from the office. Another word is forfeit. Forfeit means to suffer the loss of something by wrongdoing or noncompliance, to lose or give up something. He forfeited his last chance of an early, re re early release from jail by breaking walls of prison. He loses his last chance by breaking walls of prison. The parents forfeit earning of their whole life to educate their children. The parents give up earning of their whole life to educate their children. The manager, is go the manager is going to forfeit his own salary in order to provide his staff's lunch facility. The manager is going to give up his own salary. Ransom. Ransom is to deliver, especially in context of sin or relevant penalties, to pay a price to set someone free from captivity or punishment. Ransom is the sixth word. Ramson was abducted as soon as he ransomed. As soon as he ransomed the money to kidnappers, the police seized it back and gave it to him along with his son. Another seventh word is corroborate. Corroborate means to confirm or support something with additional evidence to attest or vouch for. I still don't believe that he is the fraud and it was corroborated by one of his close relative. It was stated by it was confirmed. Uh, it, it was confirmed uh, by his close relative, one of his close relative, with additional evidence. Another word is tacit. Tacit means expressed in silence, implied but not made explicit silent. Those husband and wife are still happy despite spending life in austerity. I am amazed to see their tacit understanding. We are weak because only Indiva has some tacit understanding, said Koirala. We couldn't deliver as powerful opposition. Ninth word is flounder. Flounder means to fluff around as a fish out of water to make clumsy attempts to move or regain one's balance. For a yank Dormi's leg vigorously, causing her to flounder and eventually fall. He was floundering to get the desired position by giving flowers to his supervisor to impress her. Tenth word is flop. Flop means to fall heavily due to lack of energy. He flopped down in front of the television, exhausted from work. It was his flaw that he flopped at the chair where Cat was sitting. 
Gripe. Gripe means to complain, to whine, to annoy or bother. What's griping you? What's griping you? You seem upset today. One political party's major gripe about other is that the leader, wa leader has refused to abide by party decisions. She griped about wasted graves. Another word is allegiance. Allegiance means loyalty to some cause, nation, or ruler. Ali and Jian has allegiance towards their nation, so they, they don't think of moving abroad anyway. Another word is sub insubordinate. Insubordinate, mean, insubordinate means rebellious or defiant to authority. Subhana is being insubordinate these days by not obeying what, is, what his parents say. Insubordinate means rebellious, defiant. Another word, 14th word is hubris. Hubris means excessive pride, presumption, and arrogance. Ruby has used hubris of being wealthy, so people don't like her. The deal, uh, the deal between Prime Minister KP Oli and his co-chair in uh, co-chair in the Nepal Communist Party, Pushpa Kamal Dahal, intensified in November with Dahal accusing Oli of perfidy, insubordination, incompetence, corruption, egotism, and hubris. Hubris means excessive pride. Perfidy. Perfidy means a state of a state or act of violating faith or allegiance, violation of promise or vow or trust. Paris always has a perfect perfidy to deceive everyone. Contortion means the act of contorting, twisting or deforming something, especially oneself, a bent position or sap, to twist in a violent manner. Within the Communist Party, the, the, this propensity for conflict is aggravated by the party's ideolo ideological contortions and the competing vested interests of its aging senior leaders. The dangerous contortion allowed us to see the full extent of her, of her flexibility. She got no countable tears because of her husband's contortions. Inept, inept means not, uh, not able to do something, not proficient, displaying incompetence. See why? Because she was inept in handling things around. She was inept. She was unable uh, to uh, handle things around. The Nepali, the Nepali Congress was not always so inept when it came to political matters, according to Thapa. It in the was is premeditated, means planned, considered, and estimated in advance, deliberate, premeditated assault. Premeditated assault, premeditated uh, robbery. Rice, uh, rice groups say the robbery was premeditated. Diamond Ocean, this is an idiom, said about anything that is common, inexpensive, and easy to get available anywhere. We don't need someone like him in this company. People with his skills are a diamond ocean these days. They, we can find people like uh, him everywhere. Uh, people uh, with his skills are diamond dojin these days, are available everywhere. This, this means. 20th and last word is mom. Mom in silence and circuit. Oli keeps mom and revoking ordinance, leaving all confused and guessing. Mom was mom when my father was yelling at me. So this, this was the first last word of the day. I discussed about uh, 20 words. Uh, please uh, uh, watch the video again to uh, memorize the word for a long time. Uh, for, for today, I'm... Um, I'm going to leave, so take care. I'll be back with another vocabulary video very soon. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.